All right, guys, welcome back. Let's try and talk to everybody. Wait, was this anybody's room? It's open. Oh, it's Barrett's. Hey, buddy. You're the only one whose hey, relationship hasn't about increased. That Yuffie kid. What do you think she wants with us? Be honest. Like Tifa said, your autograph. That made him happy earlier when she said it. Uh, the burden oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, what was that? Good thing Practicing his autograph. Let me prove it to you. Okay, we actually got his up a little bit. No chest. Simba didn't waste any time getting our names and faces out here, did they? Rest up while you can. I'll let you know if anything happens. Shinra didn't waste any time getting our names and faces out here, did they? Oh, how cute. Just a photograph of a, um, of a rabbit. Tifa? I saw in here? No. Talking to yourself? Hey, buddy. This town reeks of fish and brine. Should Shinra come calling, I doubt I'll smell them till it's too late. We'll manage. Don't worry. Never thought you could. We'll manage. The other two sounded mean. <laughs> it feels like I have fish bones in my nose. No, oh, hold on. Is that it? So Red 13 knows she's talking to herself, though. Or not talking to herself, talking to someone else, because he was in there. That shit was weird, bro. Where is Tifa, dude? Is she upstairs? Let me check outside. There. She went forward though. Guess she went up. There she is. Just about to come find you. Yeah, I. You. Regret what I said in calm. There we go. Oh. Come in. Finally, because you blew it in calm, Cloud. Big time. I should have never doubted you. It's fine. I never should have doubted you either. Say, do you remember a guy named Emilio? Emilio. General store kid, no sorry. The general store kid? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway. I ran out of time on that one. I'd never see him again. Then one day last year, he shows up. I was gonna hit her with the, the only person I remember is you. My eyes. He was all 
grown up. Didn't even recognize him at first. Really? Yeah, and what's more, the woman who walked in with him was stunning. Like, she could have been a model, and... You're... not interested, are you? Not really. But I I'm happy to listen, so go ahead. It's Bro. Okay. Forget it. What was that, Cloud? Oh my god. Was this another test? No, it wasn't. I... <sighs> Why deny it? I guess it was, huh? I'm sorry. It's fine. We'll find time to talk. Just the two of us. Figure things out. Yeah, that's not gonna happen, bro. Just be ready to spill your guts, huh? <laughs> With my iron stomach? <laughs> nice. Like I said many times, I'm not really a shipper, but I ship them so hard. Ooh. Let's look around before we go in. Oh, just a materia sitting right here. Y'all ain't gonna take this? Bro, it's a lightning material, bro. What in the hell, dude? They're like, you know that fight that you just got your ass whooped at? Here's all this lightning material. I mean, it's not like lightning material was locked before that. Could have bought it and we did have one. Just not on the right character. But it's like the game's like just constantly reminding you, yeah, that fight you just did that you weren't prepared for. Here's the thing that would have helped a lot. Can't believe they just let a nice free lightning material just sit there on the ground. Just going to sleep after all that? I would have got something to eat. Oh. <laughs> Boy. I looked away when that. Was that Yuffie? Okay, on, yeah, it was. Hey. Oh, wow. She greeted everyone already? Damn. Okay. Now that the gang's all here, it's time you got to know me. My name is Yuffie, Materia Hunter and Elite Ninja Operative <laughs> for the Interim Wu government. I left my And all those nice materia she has. I mentioned yesterday. Long story short, I want you to join me. HQ, they just didn't understand. But you guys get it. <sighs> Don't ninjas creep around in the dark slitting people's throats? I mean, we've done some shit, but we ain't about to stoop that way. I resent that. <laughs> Although, that is something we do. Oh my god. Traveling alone so far from home is expensive. So I've been moving from town to town, hustling, scraping together enough scratch to keep sticking a 
it to the man. Until, that is, I came here. And lucky I did, because I met Rhonda. She offered me the gig of a lifetime, an assassination. And guess who the target is? Seriously, guess. <sighs> I'm thinking this Rufus. I'm thinking Rufus, because he's the head. But yeah. Company's new president, Rufus freaking Shinra. That crazy or what? And that douchebag will be here any minute now. Up there here anyway. Enjoying his fancy inauguration parade. These people had their country stolen from them. And then their son Bro. Left. Junon demands revenge. So what oh my god, I, I already know who that was. Oh, wow. Tell us more. That's gotta be um Roach. Okay. So name's you Roach. Know how Rhonda's planning on paying me with your bounty suckers. What? Wow, gotta hand it to her. The lady works oh, out. here we go. Well, this is fun. See ya. Hey. <laughs> if you manage to get away, you should try to find Priscilla. She'll get you topside. <laughs> Oh my god, Yuffie. You don't want to make me come in there and fetch you, because I would love to do it! Who's that? Roach. It's Roach or Roach, I think. I think it's Roach. Uh, let's go see our old friend. I'm coming, you creep. Boss? Honestly, how long do you intend to keep me waiting? Absence certainly makes the heart grow fonder, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Still playing hard to get, eh? Well, I've got news for you, young man. As if by fate, the Speed Demon has been entrusted with a singular task. Retrieving one Aerith game. Uh, me? You come alone? <laughs> it only takes two to tango. Besides, you and I like to go big and event. Oh, can I get a 1v1, please? No need to worry. I found the perfect stage. The city above, where we can dance up a storm. Seek me out, and we'll put our last performance to shame. With a show none shall ever forget. See you later, you crazy bastard. We might want to think about getting out of here. These people don't need more trouble. Yuffie said to talk to Priscilla if we wanted to get topside, right? Let's go find her. Damn, I thought we were going to fight him. I wish we got a fight here. Thanks for dealing with that Shinra nut job. Don't you think for even a second we did that for you? The slime ball who sold us out. Take it. Not much, but it's yours. The hell is this supposed to be? Five thousand gil. Your bounty. Thank you. Part of it anyway. You thought I'd put you through the ringer like that without making it worth your while? We're on the same side. Always have been. And what if Biker Boy had taken us in? Then I would have had to improvise, but I didn't, cause it all worked out. Worked out fine. Like I pray it will for you, Fee upstairs. Yeah, let's. <laughs> Oh, hold on. Oh, I literally just said new quest on the right. I'm looking to hire a bodyguard. My boy Salmon needs to make a delivery and I don't want a fiend even looking at him the wrong way. Come and see me if you're interested. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. 
Ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. The Frogmaster under Junon Frog Gully. Okay. Um. I'm trying to make. Should we go talk to Priscilla, or... It's only two quests. Didn't think you'd still be hanging around. Well, since you clearly don't have anything better to do, think I could put you to work? The remainder of your bounty. I need it delivered to someone. I've already got a porter picked out, too. Oh, this, this is her friend. I was about to say, that was quite a name, Salmon. Job. It's your job to get him there safe. Doesn't seem like too much of a hassle, but who exactly is this money for? My son. Haven't seen him in a spell. Not since he left town. And never looked back. This gills me washing my hands of him. He's a grown man. Can't be clinging to his mom's skirt. Is it Freddy? Or her pocketbook. The crow's nest. Boy got sick of living under this steel sky. And my thumb, I suppose. So he went into the mountains way east of here. Found some more like-minded idiots. Kinda sad, if I'm being honest. If you're gonna run away, at least go somewhere interesting. Don't half-ass it. I meant what I said. Can't afford to take care of this town and his shit. I raised him best I could. Gave him every advantage, but he's got to learn to stand on his own two feet. And you think giving him this money is going to do that? I've got someone else to take care of now. Don't I, Sam? <laughs> Much obliged. Once you make it to the crow's nest, find Toby. He'll make sure you get the reward I promised. But if I find a single hair out of place on Sam, you won't live to enjoy it. You keep my boy safe. Okay, so protect Sam. Protesters. Don't drop it now. Brittle houses in the sea air. Pink chipping. Hey, where is this quest? Under there, do we have to swim from the water? I think we might have to. Oh, there's some materia down there. Brittle houses in the It's purple materia.
location may look like it's in dire straits, but what do we got? HP up materia, sweet. I'll take it. And a chest. Ether. Nothing makes you forget a bad day. The brighter the ocean. Careful not to go over there because I don't know if it'll auto start cutscene or something. We should have never let them build a reactor in Is this it? Oh no, I thought that was a door. I mean it is one, but not one we could open. Young Luffy? You're a kid? Well, duh. It's just how this place is. I don't know if it's because of the reactor out there or what, but hanging out here turns you into a frog. And you guys think that's safe? Not Shinra, I hope. Oh no, we're definitely not. Oh wait, you must be the ones Priscilla was talking about. She told me how you saved her. Right, that's us. We're friends. Are you a friend of hers too? We're friends, but it's not like I like her or anything. Okay, so it's you just, like her. There aren't a lot of other kids in the village, so I basically had to be your friend. <laughs> of course. So what are you kids doing all the way down here? Uh, playing Jump Frog, obviously. Actually, we could use a couple more players. Since you're here, do you want to give it a try? <laughs> Hmm. Come on, Cloud. Ribbit? Diva. I tried to warn you. Like I said, hanging out here turns you into a frog. But don't worry. All you gotta do is start thinking like a frog. And you'll be fine. Ribbit. 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 Oh my god, we have to fight them as frogs. We got a stagger. I was about to say, we got a frog limit.
This is so goofy. Thanks for that. So, ready to play? Come on, I love it. I promise. Ribbit? Ribbit. Okay, here are the rules. A circle to leap over incoming obstacles. And dash to safety with R2. Remain on the platform as long as you can to prove your amphibian finesse. Get knocked off, tough. Get knocked off though, and you'll croak. Think you two can it? Rank three. You get enfeeblement ring. Oh, you get one for each. All right, cool. Doesn't seem too bad. And then that shit starts spinning hella fast. Oh, I gotta be careful. Uh-oh, it's definitely... Oh my god. Yeah, we're going back. We gotta get the three. That played worse. The uh, rank two and three. Again for your help. You can come back again if you want. You look like you were having fun. Uh, it was kind of fun. <laughs> I could get used to it. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Ribbit, ribbit. Hey, ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Come on. Wait, let me see Barrick. He has a little thing on his arm. Oh, Red 13 was the one with the glowing ass. Okay, that makes sense. Alright, we gotta survive a uh, 1 minute and 20 seconds. Just gotta keep moving, don't get caught. Under two. What? I was not expecting the floor to drop. If I go the other way. Some, I got some going here. I mean, it's catching up, but whoa, this is cheese, bro. Don't no! I had something going there, though. All right, just stick to the uh. It's gonna get harder though when the platform starts breaking. Oh, we can just. Oh my god, this is so cheese, bro. Just do this until we get to the part where they start breaking.
Yo, that jump has hang time, bro. Okay. No! Hold on. I think that makes you feel branch toad at the start of battle. Hell no. Let's give it one more attempt. And then we'll go do the other side quests. land on top of one of these it count it does it count as a hit well no I messed up okay as soon as you touch it all right let's just stick to the middle I know I said one more. Alright, last attempt. Last attempt, I swear it. Oh, 
Okay, don't ask me why I jumped there. I wanted to see... Oh, this is a legit last attempt, I swear. Was close. Okay, I did say last attempt. I'll be back. This isn't the last, you meddling kids are gonna see me. There he is. Ready, Salmon? to get you is gonna have to go through me damn hey cloud remind me how old were you when you left home 14 Wait, 14 years so 13, 13 years old when he left you are usual for small town boys like you what'd your mom have to say not much didn't try to stop me like you said not the unusual that is about it, but she offered me that to make a fresh start. <laughs> Guess moms are the same all over. I turned the money down though. Didn't need it since I was planning to enlist straight away. <laughs> but you still can't help me. Was I gonna say that was a fact I did not know about Cloud? It was 13 when he left home. What a weird world. This is a new enemy. Any excuse to keep them at home. What about it? 
love the parents are like that. But I told myself I'd be different. I'd never keep my little girl from flying. Oh, I shit. Clip her wings. I wanted to soar. <laughs> I hear you scoffing. You think I can't do it? You think I'll keep her all to myself? Oh, yeah. And that's what scares me. As much as I want to let her fly, that's what I think also. I don't know if I'll be able to let her go when the time comes. Maybe I'll panic. Get in the way, hold it down, all to keep us safe. Oh, one lead. I wish you could be my baby girl forever. <laughs> Don't overdo it. Let me hear you. Thank you. I'll show you what I can do. Can you take over for me? Nothing's actually attacking him, so it's like, what are we even protecting? Alright, let me shut up before something actually does go down, though. Cover. Hmm, decent amount. Cloud, I didn't even. Oh, he's... Thank you, Salmon, for waiting. Bro, what? Okay, here we go. Also, that was funny. Salmon, wait, hold on, I gotta pet him. Good boy. What is that on the tree? Damn, you take your eye off him for a second and he just goes blitz and... Oh, a tower. Yeah, we don't got time for that. Come back to it. She did say he was in the mountains. Oh! Get that assess. Oh my god, I just got petrified. You've been petrified. Taking a certain amount of damage while in this state will turn you to stone, rendering you incapac incapacitated. Avoid damage until the status wears off, or cure the ailment with Asuna remedies or other spells or items uh, with similar effects. Deal with that. We'll be switching to Tifa. Take care. 
of them. This one's for you. Oh, that dog better back the hell up. Oh, the dog guy. Hit you. The only downside about these double spells is they take so long to... So paranoid that I'm gonna miss an assess. Okay, I'm trying to get the. Oh, I'm triggering myself. Enemy intel. Here we go. Materia Guardian. Oh, this is when we fought with Sephiroth in the demo, right? Sandstorm Drake. Okay, we did get it. Looks like we're here. Is that her son? What are you doing here? <laughs> Came all this way and you're still full of energy. Uh, do I know you? We're Sam's bodyguards. Your mom hired us to keep him safe and to make sure her boy got his allowance. <laughs> keep it. I ain't taking her money. I can make ends meet on my own. Who are they, Dylan? Friends of yours? 
Oh wow, Claire, he's got a pregnant what are you wife. Doing out of bed? You know you need to stay off your feet. Bro, you better take that money from your way, mom. I can't accept that. Just make sure Sam gets home safe for me. You really are your mother's kid. Got her stubbornness and everything. Have it your way. Why don't you hang on to it? This is a fortune. If you really don't want it, I'll take it off your hands. But as a parent, I'm sure you want to give your kid the best life you can. And in my experience, that don't come cheap. Think it over. That's true. We'll take it. Whoa. Dilster was looking for you, dude. Toby. Sorry, got a little tied up. Hang on, aren't these guys with Avalanche? Rhonda said I might run into you. Avalanche? Sharpshooter Companion Volume you mean, 1. They're the ones who blew up those reactors? The superstars themselves. I just want to say it is such an honor to meet you. Actually, while you're here, think I could ask you for a favor? Seeing as Dylan's uh, situation seems to be taken care of? Yep, it's all good. Excellent. In that case, why don't we step into my office for a chat? Right this way. You think my mom knew about me and Claire and the baby? Of course she did. That's why she I'm sent you a we fortune. To meet you. Almost feels like this little one brought us together. Wow. Grossness. Man, you Mid-Carinos are something else. When I saw you on the news, I was blown away. And here you are, lending me a hand. It's literally a dream oh. come true. Is this a... It's probably not, but I don't remember the crows, crow's nest. this I remember this from OG this might be a new area um before we talk to him let's uh rest and stuff oh, I just ran right by it all right I'll see you guys in the next part